Select your station and double click the hardware icon. Double click the analog module to open its properties. To enable diagnostics, put a check in the box Diagnostic Interrupt. Then place a check in the Group Diagnostics box under each channel group that you want to report diagnostics. The first group covers the first two channels or inputs, 0 and 1. If any channel group is unused, you should deactivate it. Click the Measuring Type field to select the input signal for this channel group. The default measuring range is 4 to 20 milliamps, which is what we want. You will need to choose the measuring type for each channel group. For channels 4 and 5, the measuring type will be thermocouple. The measuring range will be type K. You can choose the interference frequency to protect against for each channel group. The checkbox hardware interrupt when limit exceeded allows you to set a high limit and low limit range for channel 0 and channel 2. If we were to set the high limit at 18 milliamps and the low limit at 6 milliamps, then if the signal goes below 6 milliamps or above 18 milliamps, the organization block OB40 will be called for. The user can program the desired action in OB40. More help can be found in the S7 help files. You can also change the module's address in the Addresses tab. Click OK to close the Properties box. After changes are made in the hardware configuration, be sure to save and compile and download to the PLC. Some hardware analog modules have to be set up to match these software settings before being installed on the rack. That is covered in a separate video. Parameterizing digital modules is also covered in a separate video. This concludes the video.